Hey Virgo, so as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe, and this is Blue Aura Healing, Guidance, and Tarot. This is going to be a general message for our Virgos, okay? So Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, or North Node, it really doesn't matter, love. If you in any way at all identify as a Virgo, then this message is for you, okay? Virgo, please do like, share, and subscribe. Okay, let us see Virgo. What are the messages? Okay, Virgo. Thank you, Spirit. Virgo. Uh, someone's manipulation or deceit has been exposed to you um, in some way. Okay, and I feel like it kind of came as a shock. Okay, it came as a shock. All right, and now that you're finding out about this, all right, you're ready to just move forward and progress. Um, you're feeling like this person is a burden. Okay, they're per a burden. They're dead weight. Okay, you're just ready to move forward. Some of you could have been married to this person. Okay, um, or in a committed relationship with them for a really long time, five or more years okay if not married but you're starting to realize that um something's changed okay either their behavior has changed their patterns have changed something has changed okay um you did notice that much so finding out that this person has been disloyal to you or they have betrayed you in some way is definitely going to come as a surprise okay but like i said it's going to expose to you that this person is not your equal Okay, they're not your equal, is what spirit is saying. Okay, all right. All right, so we have the King of Cups coming out as the first card here. It could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces person. Um, that you guys are dealing with who we're referring to right now. I feel like, yeah, the decision has been made. Okay, you were struggling with making a decision with the two of wands coming out in the upright position. Um, you were struggling with making a decision about this person or about this connection when it comes to whether or not you should move on or what you should do. Okay, I feel like this person expresses a lot of love and compassion and things like that for you. Um, but with the King of Wands coming out here, okay, I feel like what they're missing is accountability. It's like the person refuses to accept accountability for something or something like that. Okay, like I said, a form of betrayal. They lied to you. They cheated on you. They did something with the seven of swords there okay they did something um strength card here all right we also have a, a heavy emphasis on a leo in you guys is reading but other fire signs are possible um if not leo aries or sagittarius as well okay but um i feel like you're just gonna grow from this okay you're gonna heal you're gonna grow from it you're gonna move on that's what it feels like okay um, yeah, because the four of swords is like, okay, you become over something. You know, the person is here offering you this love and you're like, yeah, no, I'm good. Thanks, but no thanks. Okay, that type of energy. The ace of swords is here. You know, I'm setting myself free. I'm clear on what it is that I need to do or what it is that I want to do. Okay, with that ace of swords. And, um... the moon yeah so it's like okay um something has become very clear to you who this person is has become very clear to you heavy emphasis on scorpio um so heavy emphasis on scorpio and heavy emphasis on leo and you guys is reading okay um but yeah this person you know they're not who they pretended to be or they're not who you thought they were you thought this was your forever person you're starting to realize now that you guys may just not be equally yoked they're not your match they're not your person something like that okay with the uh, faith card and the six of pentacles in reverse with the will of fortune as the underlying energy you guys are just moving forward okay lots of energy here that says and suggests you're moving forward the chariot the um the world okay so a ending a conclusion okay moving forward that's it not looking back okay that's where you guys are with it
Okay, yeah. So you realize in what way you were being deceived or in what way you were being manipulated here. All right. So you're just like, that's it for that. You know, that's all, folks. <laughs> okay, everything here suggests you're moving forward from the chariot to the world card. Okay, <laughs> to the will of fortune. Um, you're just not beat. Okay, that's what it feels like. Okay, yeah, the call. Honor the risk, the whisper of your soul. So, yeah, Spirit is telling you it's just not your person. Okay, I feel like your soul has been telling you that. Honor it, listen to it, trust it, be out. <laughs> All right, so you're, look, look, look what's underneath the Wheel of Fortune. Again, the chariot, double emphasis, moving forward into your destiny, into your purpose, to your life calling, into what you're supposed to be doing. Um, okay, that's it. So if this was your message or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hungry.